Today we're going to talk about why it's important to look after your tires and what you need to do and what you need to keep an eye on as you go traveling. Unlike your car, this isn't going down the road every other day. You're only using it six months out of the year. So what happens if we have too much sun on this rubber, it's going to crack and you're going to have a blowout down the road. So definitely find a way to cover your rubber over the winter, be it tire covers, be it a piece of plywood, it really doesn't matter. Just keep the sun off those tires for the winter. Some of the other things we need to look at when we're traveling is the wear pattern on our RV. So if you look at the treads, is it evenly worn? If you're worn on the inside, that can indicate that you're overloaded or possibly that your axles aren't quite where they should be anymore. If they're worn on the outside, it could be that we have too much of a turn in your axle and that's something to look at as well. So we always want to try and see an even wear on the tires. The other thing we need to keep in mind is the tire pressure we run at. If you've bought an older RV, there's a good chance that the tires have been changed over time. So when you look at the owner's manual, it may say that you run at 45 PSI. Yet on the tires, it says 55. On older RVs, I would suggest that you stick with the rated tire pressure. But on newer RVs, definitely pay attention to what your user manual says. Now, if you make sure to look after your tires, make sure they wear evenly, make sure to keep the sun off of them. They're going to keep you and your family safe for years to come, and you're going to have a great vacation.